Hey everyone, this is Tim Rio with Digital Health Live uh, down here at CES 2014, sponsored by Idea Life. Thanks, Jason. And I want to give a shout out to Brian, who's working the videos today. Thanks, Brian, for doing such a great job, and our team, Ben. Um, Laura Mitchell was just here at the Point of Care Everywhere panel, and you are with Business Development with Grand Care Systems. Yep, I'm the VP of Business Development for Grand Care Systems, and uh, we've been around since 2005, and um, basically responsible for B2B partnerships, so that would be like long-term care providers, uh, medical providers, in-home care providers, and then, of course, you know, insurance, the payers, insurance providers, and things like that. What's fun about the Digital Summit is I see, I see you on Twitter all the time, and then you actually get to meet the people that are behind the uh, Twitter curtain. That's right. Yeah, it's, it's, it's interesting because there's a lot of people that you find out that you actually knew a lot about them already, which is sort of the, the value of technology um, in a different way. Social media provides that information, extraneous information about people like Facebook and things yeah. like that, you know, um, whereas technology in our field also provides interesting and meaningful data about, about our, you know, the patients and the providers utilizing the system. So it's kind of in the same way. So the topic point of care everywhere, what does that mean? So point of care obviously is just the, the care delivered by a physician or a primary care physician. And um, you know, where is the where is the point of care? Well, is it in the hospital? Um, is it in the, you know, in the doctor's office? And the, the notion of point of care everywhere is that maybe it could be everywhere. Maybe you wouldn't have to actually physically travel to get to receive your care. If you lived in a rural area, maybe you'd be able to receive that care um, from the doctor remotely. Okay, okay. Who else was on the panel? I see we had a number of folks from Scanadu, Connected Health, Center for Connected Health, Grand Care, Vital Connect. What was, who else was there and what were they talking about? Um, it was interesting because we got um, to hear from United Healthcare about the, from the payer perspective. So she was talking a little bit about reimbursements, um, how that they view innovation really um, being a part of, of telemonitoring and telemedicine. Um, and the United Health Group is actually very innovative as far as that goes. Um, Dr. Kavedar from Connected Health told us a little bit about their initiatives. It was interesting from a uh, physician perspective to hear how he how vital he thought um, telemonitoring and telemedicine was. So that was interesting. And then we got to hear from, from the other two folks um, about um, they actually create those wearable technologies and chronic disease management technologies. So three of us kind of of were you know suppliers or manufacturers of the actual technology. So what excites you and, and what are you doing at Grand Care? Um, what's exciting to me is that this industry is finally starting to move. Um, yeah. I've been at it um, since 2005, January of 2005 with Grand Care and we've seen everything from the tire kickers to now where those um, medical providers are actually coming to us and saying okay we're ready to do this um, yeah. versus you know five years yeah. ago they were fixing to do it and you know or you know putting it in the budget for the next five years or something so okay. it's exciting to see this innovation and of course you know to actually be bettering people's lives and saving money it doesn't hurt either. Nice work, nice work. So what's it for you? What kind of people are you trying to connect with here and with Grand Care? So at CES, you yeah, mean? Yeah. yeah, yeah. Um, at CES, it's more like we, we really develop our business-to-business -business partnerships here. We um, everyone sort of is here. Um, I always enjoy the Digital Health Summit. I enjoy the work that Jill Gilbert's doing, yeah. um, and I also really like walking around the space and finding you know the, the millions of health-related apps. Just shows that the time has come. You know, it's in the early days we didn't have very many competitors, and at first you're like, yay, and then you're like, oh no, you know. <laughs> um, so now it's really exciting because this space is just bubbling with enthusiasm and there's lots of innovation happening. So how do people connect with you personally on Twitter and whatnot and then what about your website? Okay, so they can connect with me on Twitter at Laura H. Mitchell or at Grand Care and our website is grandcare.com. All right, well that was fun, Laura. Always good to see you looking great and thanks for being on the show. Thank you.